What's I? Corner grinders, cobras, Miyagi does, Miyagi fangs, eagle fangs, eagle dews, and any and everybody else out there. Welcome to Monday. Time to get up, turn it on, push it out. Time to grind. And I'd like to say a lot more this morning, but I got my buds in and I'm listening to this fantastic song that's getting me pumped. Makes me want to go and just knock it out today. So, I'm not going to talk much. You're just going to have to deal with the voiceover during the actual workout. And today's inspirational message, all about music. So, pop your own buds in and let's commence to get inspired and grinding. Banzai! I've been in the cave 40 days, only a spark to light my way. I want to give out, I want to give in. This is our crime, this is our sin. But I still believe, I still believe, through the pain and through the grief, through the lies, through the storms, through the cries and through the wars, oh, I still believe, I still believe. That is some of the opening lyrics to the song I Still Believe by Tim Capello which you may remember as the buff saxophone player from the movie uh, Lost Boys. Great movie, great soundtrack, great song. And I want to let you in on a little secret on that. Uh, it was August, it was Friday, August 20, 2020. And uh, I was listening to the Lost Boys soundtrack while I was doing my workout that morning that was pre-tonal and um you know later that day I found out that my brother had passed and even though I loved that music so much you know one of the songs that really got me fired up was going to have a good time tonight uh that may not be the exact title but that's the that's the catchphrase but anyway I could not listen to that music for the longest time you know a stupid, stupid part of me thought because I was so pumped up and excited about having a good time that that's what caused such tragedy in our lives, which is stupid, self-centered, but it is what it is. So, but music is an extremely powerful force. Uh, I'm always listening to music that gets me up. Now, generally, I like something a little harder, a lot of drums, some good guitar, but that's me personally. I know different people get pumped from different things. And whatever you get pumped with is what works for you. But I would strongly encourage you go ahead and get some music in there. Uh, it makes a huge difference. If you've ever seen a movie with the soundtrack removed, you know that without the music, the musical cues underlying the visuals, it just doesn't have that same impact. A great example of this is Jaws. You know, when you hear that da 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 that slowly speeds up, you know the shark is there slowly moving around, zeroing in on his prey. And, you know, same with if you come in something modern, you know. the I think there's a new Indiana Jones getting ready to come out. So, you know, dun da da dun da dun da or whatever it is. You know that sound, you know, you know that music and it, it says something to your soul. And that's what I think good music does. And I can't stress it enough. Pop your buds in or crank it up and listen to whatever music really gets you going. For me, it tends to be 80s hair metal bands. I like that stuff, but I also dig Shine Down, you know, uh, I would consider Bon Jovi in the first one, but uh, there's a new modern band that plays 80s rock called Airborne. Uh, love to go see them sometime. And the Lost Boys soundtrack. And believe it or not, and this is going to make some people scratch their head, I really enjoy the uh, Once More With Feeling soundtrack from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Um, it tells a story, and it, it's pretty darn good. So, all right, you've seen most of the workout. Um, I've sped this up a little bit, and uh, 
I don't know how much more there is to go. I think, I think right now we're just going to do the biceps, and then uh, we go to the uh, calf raises. I tried to move this so you could see the arm a little bit, but I don't know if it's going to stay in focus because I do have a vein that's popping out. So excited for that. Uh, but unfortunately, the camera's not going to get it in focus. Well, oh well. That's not the important thing. That's just my vanity popping through. Uh, after this, we will be doing the uh, extras from uh, Jeff Cavalier and Athlete X, the stuff he put out, Bigger Arms in 30 Days. Mondays are biceps. And... Um, and unfortunately, you're going to get a real good shot of my bald head. Oh, good. I'm underneath it, so you don't get to see it as much. Perfect. I was afraid it was going to focus in on my little bald spot growing back there. But um, not using a lot of weight here. It's lighter weight. We're going to do 5-5-5 five, five, and five, and then drop it 5 pounds and do 5-5-5 five, five, and five again. So, uh, And by this time, your arms are noodles. So um, will I get bigger arms in 30 days? I really don't think so, but... Uh, it's fun to add this on, and I like doing arm work, so this is exciting and fun for me. And, you know, I thought all weekend about the music I was going to listen to today, and this song, I still believe, is, even though it's not a real hard song, it's upbeat, it's pretty fast-paced, great saxophone, and so I just love it. And I encourage you to find what you love what music do you listen to? I am very curious to hear what everybody else likes to listen to when they're working out. So if you got a moment, pop it down in the comments. I will read and respond. Other than that, have a great day. Bonsai, and we'll see you next time. <sighs> All right. That's the workout for today. At least as far as you're concerned. I still got one more set, six reps, plus the extra arm stuff. <sighs> you do that twice. You do five incline, five sitting up, five bending over. Then you're supposed to drop it five pounds and do five, five, and five again. And it's a good workout. Ooh, we're already feeling a little noodly. So that's all I got for today. Bonsai, thanks for tuning in. Let me know what kind of music you like to listen to down in the comments. But have a great day. Bonsai. Bang!